I'm John Oler King from Elmwood, Nebraska, and been farming for about 30 years. Both my father and my grandfather pushed me to get my education. I remember riding with them in the combine one day saying, you know, get your education. That's the one thing they can't take away from you. When I graduated from the University of Nebraska, I came back and we were just going to integrate me back into the dairy and, and work into the farming operation. And uh, then in, in the year 2000, we, we exited the dairy business and and it just happened to be uh, almost divine intervention. Uh, a gentleman I'd been helping for, for years all through high school and decided to retire and offered me to purchase his land. We doubled the size of our operation. I was able to come back and, and continue working on the farm. What brought me back was probably wanting to continue that legacy and carry on the tradition that my the generations before had, kind of wanting to make them proud. So, so when the farm was transitioned over to me, it was like, holy cow, uh, there's a lot of pressure on me to make this thing succeed, and, and still is. I like to try things first. I, you know, I want to I want to see if I can get that competitive edge or find something really cool. We've been collecting data for many years, but the problem has usually been is who can interpret the data or or what to do with that data once you do have it. I actually started with climate back in 2012, uh, and that was when they first started as an insurance company. Shortly after that, I was in St. Louis and was at a meeting where they were talking about this new product and uh, it was gonna be able to do all these different things. I thought, wow, that sounded pretty neat. Before Field View, you got a bunch of pretty maps and then that's all they did was they were pretty maps that sat on, on your desk. Being able to collect that data and have it all in one place and then being able to sit there and, and analyze it on my own and save me time and money. With Field View, we've learned so much more about what we're doing out there and what we can be doing and use those to make decisions. My grandfather and my father both said, you know, whatever you get, leave it better than how you found it. I want it for a future generation and possibly more than that. Hopefully my son will be able to benefit from that and his children as well. And so that's always a challenge and it's exciting at the same time that now that we have some of those tools to figure out how to improve that. <laughs>